Academy Stars, Year 6, Unit 8, Tell Me a Story. Lesson 6, Writing, Page 6, 102 to 103. Lesson Objective, write a summary of a story where you identify the main events in the text, working with words synonyms. Look at the story on pages 96 to 97. Find and underline the main characters in the story. The main events do not include unnecessary information like small details or explanations. This chart will help you write a summary of a story. Write in pairs to complete it with notes about the perfect swan. Someone. Who are the main characters? What do we need to know about them? The Chinese emperor and the painter. Wanted? What did the emperor want? He wanted a painting of a swan. So, what did the emperor do? He asked the best painter in China to paint one for him. But, what was the problem? After three years, the emperor was still waiting for his painting. Then, what happened in the end? Then, the artist painted a perfect swan in two minutes. The emperor was astonished. Read a summary of another story. Answer the question. Do you think it's a good summary? Why? Why not? What information do you think is important? Find and underline it. Once, there was a poor farmer. He didn't have any money. And he was hungry all the time. One day, he discovered a special goose on his farm. The goose was fed with lots of white feathers. Every day, it laid a golden egg. The eggs were beautiful and shiny, and the farmer was very happy. The farmer sold the eggs and became rich. He had food and a warm house, and he didn't want to work on his farm anymore. But he was very greedy. He didn't want to wait for just one egg each day. He wanted all the eggs at once. The farmer opened the goose's mouth. He reached deep inside the goose to find more golden eggs, but there weren't any. After that, the goose never laid another golden egg. So what's the important information do you find it? Once, there was a poor farmer. And then, one day, he discovered a special goose on his farm. And every day, it laid a golden egg. The farmer sold the eggs and became rich. But he was greedy. He didn't want to wait for just one egg each day. He wanted all the golden eggs at once. The farmer opened a goose mouth. He reached deep inside the goose to find more golden eggs, but there weren't any. And then after that, the goose never laid another golden egg. Work in pairs, use your notes from activity 2 to write a summary of the perfect one using no more than 100 words. Once, there was a Chinese emperor. He wanted a painting of swan, so he asked the best painter in China to paint one for him. After three years, the emperor was still waiting for his painting and he was furious. Then, the artist painted a perfect swan in two minutes. The emperor was astonished, but he was still furious and sent the painter to another country. Then, the servant found thousands of paintings of a swan. The painter had practiced every day until he could paint the perfect swan. The emperor apologized to the painter, who returned to live in the palace. Working with words, synonyms. Synonyms are words that mean the same. For example, big and large or fast and quickly. When you write, try not to repeat the same words. Think of synonyms to make your writing more varied and interesting. Strong, powerful, angry, furious. Look at the story on pages 96 to 97 and then find synonyms for these words. Go back, return, surprise, astonish, fantastic, magnificent, very bad. Terrible. Thanks for watching. Do click like and subscribe for more videos.